What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. What is good? All right, so it is now Monday. Yeah, Monday the 31st. Um, I'm now headed to the gym for some faster cardio. Um, I have school at 11, actually. Art history, too. So, um, trying to get in some faster cardio and get my food in before I go to school. Today's my first day of like going to school, going to work, and going to the gym and doing YouTube. So this should be very interesting. Um, going to, actually gonna stop by Walmart. I don't really like Walmart, but they have pretty good prices on monsters. <laughs> so I have to go to Walmart, but I get a monster and probably some, um, Cliff Builder Bars. So. What's really good, people? I'm um, leaving class now. Art history. Eh, you know, it's boring. Like, <laughs> like typically art history is. But it wasn't that bad. It's with a teacher that had um, a previous semester, so we already had that kind of rapport. So it should be pretty um, pretty easy. I'm, I'm good at writing, so... Um, I suspect that I will be doing pretty well. Um, so yeah, I'm about to do that. I just did that. So now I'm about to go to the bank, cash my check here. Um, and then we're gonna have lunch. Then hit the gym, we got leg day today. I'm not sure I will be able to get any footage of a leg day, cause I mean, it's a little harder. Cause I don't have a um, a camera yet, or or if I, if I had a camera, I don't have a, a tripod or anything like that. So, um, yep. Yeah, so, yeah. So I'm gonna do that, and then um, I have work after that. And I work four to ten. So I'll check out with y'all later. Peace. I swear, man. It's like construction every damn day. It's crazy. <sighs> Having some um, fruity pebbles. It's a pre-workout snack. So here we go. Got some half a cup of chickpeas, some about 50 to 60 grams of seitan, and then we got um, seitan or vital wheat gluten for people. So, vital wheat gluten, if you can't understand. I'm not saying Satan, I'm saying seitan. Anyway, um, yeah, and I got some um, half a cup of rice as well with some organic ketchup and some sriracha. So, this is gonna be my lunch pre workout meal as well. Um, I had that cereal before this, and then um, oh, I'm gonna hit them, hit some legs. All right, talk to you later. So I just carved up, so I'll just kind of you know show you like my muscles when I'm carved up. So so I get this light, <sighs> heavy carbs. <clears throat> I didn't I didn't understand that concept when I was younger, or even just a year ago. It's like about how carbs or eating makes you look full or whatever else. Like I probably didn't have enough muscle mass to really know, but now it's like I definitely can tell, especially when I'm on this cut, when I'm not full, my muscles are flat or whatever else. So just a little tidbit. Make sure you be mindful of that. So don't freak out if you're on you're dieting, you're cutting, and you wake up in the morning you look small. Your glycogen is low and all that stuff, so of course you're gonna look small. So just stay the course. Consistency consistency. There we go.
What is up, everybody? I am running like a chicken with his head cut off. <laughs> oh, man, like, I feel like I've been going non-stop today. Like, I literally had to rush my workout. Only an hour and um, about 10 minutes, hour and 20 minutes for legs, abs, <laughs> and calves. It was killing, man. But, um, yeah, I'm on my way to work now, rushing there. And, um... Yeah, I, can't, I, I, was able, I wasn't really able to film too much. I think I was able to film maybe like a 10 second clip at the gym, but I, like I said, I was just running like a chicken with his head cut off all day. So um, hopefully soon I'll be able to get y'all some better footage, you know, some more footage of my leg day. Um, but I need to get like a tripod or something or have someone film me for that. Um, this is actually probably my most intense day and probably my favorite day. So yeah, I'm on my way to work. Um, I just had a protein bar and I had a pop tart, unfortunately. I don't really like to eat that stuff all the time, but I kind of had no choice um, because I was I had to rush up the door. So I mean, like, that's a protein bar and a pop tart is my best I could do. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. It still fits my macros though. So that's the important thing. Um, so I'm gonna have for dinner. I have the same thing I always have: the vital wheat gluten and uh, rice. And um, what else? Yeah, chickpeas, rice, vital wheat gluten. Um, when I get home, I'll have um, uh, serving of peanut butter, uh, rice cake, um, cauliflower, some cauliflower and some more about a week gluten. And that should finish off my protein and my fats and carbs and everything. So I actually been using peanut butter lately. Um, I was using ice, I was eating ice cream every night, but you know, ice cream, even low fat ones, have usually still have a lot of carbs. So now that I cut out that, um, I'm able, I'm, I'm definitely able to have, be more flexible with my carbs throughout the day. So, that's my story. All right, well, I don't know what else to say right now, so I'm gonna let y'all go, and um, maybe I'll give you a, you know, a sneak peek of my, of my job or something else, so I'll catch you later.